Wow, okay, I feel like a camera pro because the camera was like too dark and then I was like, what the heck? And then there was these buttons on the screen and I, I fixed it, so I'm pretty proud of myself. Anyways, I was watching this YouTube video and this guy was like, um, YouTube isn't uh, inspiring because, um, like, hyper, like, because, like, people like beauty gurus have really high production value, well, like, the top ones and stuff. And he was like, you know, YouTube used to be something that everyone could do. And, like, it's not, this doesn't inspire young girls to do this and this and this. And I was like, well, I'm glad I don't have that problem. Because, like, you know, anyone can be inspired to eat an onion in, in a bathtub and then complain about school and fail classes and make jokes that aren't funny. So, I'm setting the bar really low, I feel like. Not that, not, not that I'm saying like anyone aspires to be me, like, please don't come for me. Not that anyone, anyways, I don't think anyone aspires to be me. I'm just saying, I don't even know what I'm saying. If anyone knows how to use an external hard drive, I've been so stressed out because, okay, I have a MacBook Air. And most of the hard drive space is taken up by other in storage, and I just deleted all of my pictures on accident, and it didn't even free up that much storage, so somebody please help me, what do I do? Like, I will aspire to be anyone who can help me with this computer thing. I have this hard drive. Please help. <laughs> okay, bye. I just have to clarify, I wasn't trying to put myself in the same category as those people, um, or any people with talent, or anything like that, so please don't come for me being like, what are you trying to do? I'm not trying to do anything, okay? I'm really not trying to do anything. Like, I'm just trying to live my life. I'm bored, <laughs> I have nothing to do, you, have, you know that saying that's like, if you're bored then you're a boring person, well, I'm actually not bored that much, I'm usually just like stressed out, so, does that apply to everything, like, if you're stressed then you're a stressful person, I could see that, actually, you know what, I think I am a stressful person, okay, one time, actually, my friends stopped being friends with me because they said I was too much to handle. It's okay, though. It's a long story. I'm not going to get into it. And it's cool now. And they didn't really stop being friends with me. They're, like, anyways, I don't know why I brought it up. Anyways, um. No, it wasn't that I was too much to handle. It's that I caused too many problems. So I can't, oh my god, there's a chip on my lens. Um. I can't cause problems on the internet. That's a lie. You can cause problems on the internet. But, like, as long as I'm not rude, I feel like I can't cause problems on the internet. Maybe I can. Actually, I feel like it's really easy to cause problems on the internet. Never mind. I just contradict everything that I say. My mom's coming this weekend. Because I live in a different state. I don't... I kind of want to say what school I go to, but for some reason I feel like that's not a thing that you're supposed to do. I don't know why. I mean, I feel like it would be easy to figure out. Like, if someone really wanted to figure it out. But I also feel like I shouldn't say it. I don't know why. Just because, you know, like... I don't know. I don't know. But my mom's coming. And we're going to have... That's always fun because it's just going to be a good time. And we're going to go to Costco. It's going to be fun. And 
I have our Mother's Day gifts, and yeah, it's gonna be cool. Also, for that person who didn't really believe that I was in metaphysics, well, look at this metaphysics. The big questions. Let me read it to you. <clears throat> Hold on. One minute. Um. Okay. If determinism is true, then our acts are the consequences of the laws of nature and events in the remote past. But it is not up to us what went on before we were born. And neither is it up to us what the laws of nature are. Therefore, the consequences of these things, including our present acts, are not up to us. And that is from the consequence argument. Peter Van Inwegen. I probably said that wrong. Please don't come for me. Anyways, Godspeed, I guess. God, ugh.